Uh, Laura, welcome back everybody to our YouTube channel BTC TV and we continue to do videos about blockchain space and about different companies in this space. Today we are in Poland in city Krakow. Behind me Solana is organizing for the first time here a hackathon during the next couple of days. So hopefully we can meet Solana team, make some video interviews to understand why they are doing it right here in Poland. Also we can maybe find some interesting project and make interesting video interviews interviews. So let's get started this video and let's go inside. Are you ready? Let's go. Okay, we are back from this event in Krakow in Poland. Right now I'm happy to introduce you Sebastian. Sebastian, thanks for coming to our TV show. Sebastian is leading a software engineer. Uh, basically, you are really do understand uh, a lot about technical behinds of Solana. Yes, I do. <laughs> okay, uh, so a couple questions maybe. First of all, like how do you like Solana in general, uh, this network? Because like many, many other competitors on the market, Ethereum, Binance Smart Chain, and go on, and let's go on and go on. Why Solana? Yeah, sure, that, that's actually a good question. Uh, like uh, my background is in traditional finance. Okay. And before joining on Solana, I spent my entire uh, professional life working for big banks, hedge funds, and that kind of, um, uh, project and then um, obviously I was paying attention to, to blockchain space it was always interesting but it like always felt that it was not just there yet okay. and then uh, when Solana came along with the speed uh, and uh, the price for the transactions it just felt to me like yes there is something in it and uh, yeah and, and I decided to join and <laughs> they allowed me to <laughs> Okay, cool. Uh, right now we are in Poland, in Krakow. Why you decided to came to this city specifically? Well, uh, I'm Polish, okay. so it, it's you know it's my it's my home country. Okay. And uh, I love Krakow, so that that's one reason. But uh, obviously, I, I think that the hacker houses are very valuable events for the community. Mm -hmm. It's for community to get together. But for me, also as as a developer for Solana. It allows me to connect with users who actually use it, mm -hmm. the tools that I create, so I can get a uh, direct feedback okay. and I know uh, what the problems are okay. and I know what to do and also a chance actually to help them to, to also develop. Uh, uh, th you created this event like for four days or five days here, right? This house. How do you like so far this event? Uh, what is the reaction from people? Yeah, I, I think that y it's, it's, it's super cool. I think it, this one is not as crowded mm -hmm. as the other ones that uh, I've been before, but I, I think still the the same atmosphere, the, the the same kind of vibe, and yeah. Basically, if uh, somebody wants to make something on Solana, um, it's better to join such hockey house, such events with Solana. Next one in Lisbon, right? Uh, I think in September. No, no I, I think that there are more before Lisbon. Okay. Uh, there is one in Stockholm. Okay. And uh, I think one in Vancouver, uh, you have to check because the schedules keep changing, but uh, we do those hacker houses around the world. So, uh, and basically and you can meet over there with Solana team. And if you yep, have some have technical problems, some uh, questions, questions, you can address them directly at such events. Yep, yep, correct. This, this is what it's for. All right, Sebastian, thanks, thanks for coming to our uh, TV show. Uh, meanwhile, let's move on to this event and see other great stuff from it. Are you ready? Let's go.
Okay, we are continuing our videos from Solana Hacker House in the Krakow. Today I'm happy to present you Victoria from very famous Krakow Marketplace. Victoria, thanks for coming. Thank, Thank you, you for having me. me. Yeah. Can you maybe a little bit uh, make an introduction of what this Krakow uh, Marketplace is all about? Because maybe not so not everybody knows what this Krakow is all about. 100%. So Fractal's mission is to bring Web3 gaming to the masses. So we have three product pillars. The first is our NFT marketplace and our launch pad. And the second layer is our tournament. So we help to host Web3 tournaments. And lastly, we have a gaming SDK, um, namely a Fractal wallet, specifically designed for gaming, as well as marketplace API. Um, so we're looking to provide all the tools and products to help Web3 game developers develop their games on blockchain, as well as to help them connect with the Web3 gaming community. I think we need also to mention who is standing behind the fractal. This is most important yep. person because, like, if you are watching, if you are watching this video on uh, YouTube, I bet that many of you heard about Twitch one. So that's continue. right. <laughs> yes. So Fractal was founded by Justin Khan, and he was the co-founder of Twitch. Um, and then our other co-founders also have very deep experience in gaming. So Robin came. He was a prior GM for Zynga in China. And Dave, our CEO, um, was the founder of Google Drive. So our entire team has really strong um, experience, not only in gaming, but also in product engineering. So it's been a phenomenal team to work for. Excellent, excellent. Now, my next question, like, okay, we are standing right now at uh, Solana Hockey House. Why you are here? Yeah, so we are here um, because, you know, we are looking to connect more with the different game developers, specifically for our gaming SDK. So we built a gaming specific wallet um, that aims to reduce gamer onboarding friction, as well as to reduce in-game transaction friction. So we're here to just connect with different developers to tell them more about our product and help them with integration. Okay, okay cool. Now, and maybe one of the last questions will be how do you like this event so far how do you like it yeah i mean i love the event i think the energy is great um people here are really building for the right reasons and then i've met a lot of people not just developers right from a variety of background countries working on different projects in gaming DeFi. and one thing that's really cool is that we were able to meet a lot of people building outside of gaming that was interested in our products so um i would highly recommend people to attend different hacker houses if it's near you or even just travel to one for fun okay Thanks, Victoria, for coming to our TV show. Now let's go and see more interesting stuff from this event. Thank you. Thank you. All uh, right, right. This is our video regarding Solata Hair Career House in Krakow in Poland. We met here interesting people and companies. And f f before I finish this video, I just want to say thank you for watching this. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, BTC TV. Again, thanks for watching and see you in the next one. Bye for now.